Hello YouTube, this is me, Bruno98, and today in this video I'm going to show you guys how to get battery percentage on an iPod Touch 1st through 5th generation without jailbreaking your iPod. So, this also will work on the iPhone 3G, which did not have the battery percentage, and I'm pretty sure also the 2G, or the original iPhone, <coughs> whatever you want to call it. So, this does not require a jailbreak. I've already done this to mine and my sister's iPod. I would do it to my brother's iPod, but his is jailbroken, so there's no real need to. As he already has a battery percentage thing enabled via uh, Red Snow. So, I'm going to link you guys off to this website to download the free trial of iBackupBot for Windows or Mac. If you are trying to open a backup of iOS 2 or 2.x or earlier, use the older versions below it. It used to be called iTunes Backup Manager, but as of 2010, January 25th of 2010, um, it's now iBackup Bot. So, download and install it. Once it's done, you can open it as such. Now, I've already gotten the backup done. I love how it, that's my brother's iPod. It says Noah's iPod, but it's not. And I'm also going to delete the backup of Jordan's iPod. No, it deleted my backup. Well, isn't that freaking fun? Yes. So pretty much I'm going to show you guys now what the program would look like if you have no backups. Once this one deletes. Okay, so cl click on my iPod. It's iOS 6.1.3. It's the fourth generation of the device. You can back up via the program, but according to it, it's going to take for my iPod 25 minutes. And my iPod's the 8 gigabyte model from 2010 when it was launched. I got this Christmas of 2010 and it's got 1.8 gigs available. What you're going to do if you want this to be faster, if you want if you're okay with you having to go into iTunes, click automatically back up to this computer. And if it doesn't actually automatically back up, just right click and click backup. It's going to go ahead and back up my iPod and probably sync songs to it, but although it doesn't really need to. And I'll be back once this is Okay guys, the backup is now finished. It's telling me Chrome could not be transferred. But, oh well, um, just going to download Safari Safe Data. Okay, so now that that's done, you can quit out or just, you know, minimize iTunes. So now we are back here to the program, but we're going to have to quit it for the uh, backup to show up. So here we have the backup for some reason now it's not reading the device. There we go. Um, what you're going to do is click System Files. If my trackpad would like to work today. Go to Home Domain, Library, Preferences, and look for com.apple.springboard.plist. Don't bother with that. And here you go. All you gotta do from here is space or enter down, then type in 
exactly what I am typing. Once you got that, type it in SB show battery level. Then type in key. Then jump down, type in true. And that's it. That's click save. Quit that and click restore. And just so you know, I am doing this real quick right to the device. Now, I'm going to, once this part here is done, I'm going to stop the recording and bring up the webcam to show you guys that it actually does work. I'll also show that I'm not running a jailbroken iPod. So, yeah. Okay, guys. So now that I've gotten the webcam, hopefully this is coming through clearly. As you can see, it is now doing the bar. All this does is restore the plist file to the iOS version. All I'm waiting for now is for this to restart so I can edit my uh, brightness level. Because I do believe that's a bit bright for you guys to see. Is that better? A bit darker. Okay. So there's the battery percentage. This is a fourth generation iPod Touch. iTunes is launching, so as you can see, is an iPod Touch it is not jailbroken. I can go through every folder on my device. If I can get this to open. It's also running iOS version 6.1.3. I'm going to scroll down this list to show you guys. Hey, there's no jailbroken stuff in the settings. So, yeah, this does work. It doesn't, uh, it's not classified as jailbreaking your device. So, all you're doing is editing a, basically a text file to put the battery percentage on your device. Thanks for watching this video. I'm Bruno98. I'm using a wonderful software called Open Broadcast Software. It's free for Windows and Linux. I'm not sure if it's on Mac. Of course, I'm not really sure if it's on Linux either. So, and I'm going to edit this in Movie Maker as of right now until I can learn how to uh, edit properly using Lightworks. So, again, does not require a jailbreak. I know you may see the red snow icon up in the corner. I guess my zoom isn't going to do anything today. No. No, instead it decided to do the old Windows Classic type of zoom, probably because I'm not using Aero. So, yeah. Um, thank you for watching. Peace out, guys.